Κυρίε και κύριοι, καλησπέρα σα και καλώ ορίσατε στα Echo News by Day. Ένα κομβικό momentum για την πυρηνική ενέργεια βλέπει ο ελληνική καταγωγή αντιπρόεδρο κυβερνητικών σχέσεων και διεθνών υποθέσεων του Καναδικού Συνδέσμου Πυρηνική Ενέργεια, μιλώντα στον Sky από το Οικονομικό Φόρουμ των Δελφών. Όπω δηλώνει ο Τζορτ Χριστίδη, οι στόχοι για μείωση των εκπομπών διοξιδίου του άνθρακα επαναφέρουν δυναμικά την πυρηνική ενέργεια στο προσκήνιο. Mr. Christidis, welcome welcome to Sky TV. Thank you for being with us. So we're at the Delphi Economic Forum and we will be discussing today about nuclear power, uh, something that remains a taboo in Greece and in Europe in general. So uh, Canada is amongst the countries that are leading the way in nuclear power. Why and what makes nuclear power that promising? Well, first of all, thank you very much for having me. What a pleasure to be here. I'd like to maybe start the conversation, maybe to t challenge a little bit that premise of the taboo, because what we're seeing is an evolution, an international evolution, to accepting more and more nuclear energy as part of the effort to deal with the climate crisis. Canada, as you know, is a very large country. So the energy mix of Canada, nuclear accounts about 15% across the country. However, it's driven by the, each provincial jurisdiction. So each province defines its needs and has jurisdiction in terms of the commercial decision or energy mix. So in Ontario, for example, which is one of the key larger provinces from a manufacturing base, nuclear accounts about 60% of, of the electricity generation in the province, along 20% in hydro, a role for renewables and natural gas. And in Ontario's case, it was that mix of different technologies coming together that enabled the, uh, the, re the, re the reduction of use of coal energy production in that province. Proponents of nuclear energy uh, say that the goal set by the EU for 55% emissions by 55% uh, by 2030 mm -hmm. is an elusive goal uh, without the support of nuclear power. Would you see hesitant Greece and hesitant Europe moving towards nuclear energy? And when would you see that happening? Well, one can argue the, the movement is happening already. So uh, obviously countries such as France, a long history of nuclear energy. But if you look at Eastern Europe, as it's trying to define a new path forward to meet climate, but certainly energy security goals, They're already interested. Poland is interested, Romania. Other Balkan countries such as Bulgaria are looking at upgrading their nuclear platform as well. So in some ways, Greece, in the neighborhood of Greece, uh, nuclear energy is already entering the discussion and actual uh, project phase that enables, I think, an opportunity for Greece to look at this technology and consider it sometime. Κυρίες και κύριοι, σας περιμένουμε στο επόμενο επεισόδιο. Να έχετε ένα όμορφο βράδυ.